Welcome back to Ash News TV. I'm Ed Hyland, and I have the honor now of being joined by Ash President, Dr. David Williams. Dr. Williams, thank you so much for coming by. So many things happening this week in Orlando for the 57th annual. Yeah, it's great, and I want to welcome everyone to Orlando. We're, we're just thrilled with the convention space and looking forward to a terrific meeting. It's all about science here at ASH, and that's kind of the theme going through uh, the next couple of days. That's true. Uh, we have the theme of genomic medicine, and it's revolutionizing our field, as it is many fields in medicine. And you'll notice that the plenary session, the presidential symposium, many of the invited speakers and honorific speakers are, are basically going to be talking about how genomic medicine is changing what we do for our patients, the kinds of medicines we use, and the approaches we have for their therapeutic uh, treatments. What's always insightful about ASH is this is what's happening right now. This isn't even last week's news. This is basically what's being released uh, to the world of medicine right now, and, and we're hearing about it sometimes for the first time here at ASH. Yeah, just, uh, just in the last week, uh, just right now, three new drugs are being approved by the FDA for treatment of multiple myeloma. And actually, ASH has two sessions, new sessions um, that will pair experts in the use of these new drugs that are just approved uh, and provide uh, clinicians and, uh, with uh, advice about how to use these new drugs. These are very popular sessions, so we're, we're quite uh, happy to have them. We're talking about text to donate to. Tell us a little bit about uh, that campaign. The Text to Donate is a, a new campaign this year, and uh, I'll be uh, demonstrating to people uh, how, how to use the text campaign. There are the signs up all over the convention center. It's a way to try to continue to expand our support for the Ash Foundation. This is very important because as uh, funding for research uh, constricts at the federal level, stationary or stagnant, uh, we're increasingly using ASH foundations to support uh, more research and uh, support our training efforts, which are, of course, uh, are very important to, to our members. As much as ASH gives its members, it's very important to make sure that the ASH members also give back. Absolutely. And uh, I, I can tell you from talking to many people how important uh, our bridge program uh, has been in particular and also our ASH scholars program, which for the last two years we've expanded. Uh, the executive committee has voted more money into these programs to try to help young people continue to develop uh, in, in the hematology research field. Dr. Williams, thank you so much for coming by and joining us here on Ash News TV. Thank you.